Today, we're gonna write a thousand words in 10 minutes with Brainwork, which has an amazing SEO-friendly long-form AI writing assistant. They'll do AI blog titles, outlines, keyword research, everything. I'm gonna start with the keyword research, and I just picked up NextWeave as a part of Last Call, and I'm gonna be adding a hyper-personalized media experience. So I'm actually gonna just start with this keyword phrase. I think it's probably too uh, narrow, and yes, it is. So we're not getting anything. So let's instead say hyper-personalized marketing and see what that does. That's super low volume, like 10 a month. We will see that it peaked in November, but it's not even giving me trends data just because that is like super low. So instead of hyper-personalized, let's go with like personalized marketing. Okay, our volume's a lot better on personalized marketing. We have competition, difficulty, all of that is in the medium. There are a ton of search results. And because there are so many results, it's going to be quite difficult to actually get on that first page. All in all, I think personalized marketing, we'll just go with that for the sake of this video. So I'm going to come here to new post, way to go, high probability that the AI can help us. Let's click continue. And I actually love the fact that they tell me in advance. Like if I'm writing about something that they're not going to be able to help with, they're not going to waste the time. Personalized marketing will be our primary keyword. Let's go ahead and select up to five suggested keywords. So I think we're going to need to go with personalization. What is personalized marketing? Personalized marketing, personalized content. And then I'm going to add an additional keyword that again is going to be hyper personalized marketing because we did add that. It was a low overall term and that'll be our five so let's go ahead and create and we should pretty much have our document with the ai ready to assist so now we have our document editor let's open up the assistant and let's generate some titles and then once we have a title we'll generate some ideas how to personalize your marketing what is personalized marketing let's generate some more and then i think i'll just go with what is personalized marketing i like this one right here personalized marketing revolution why it's time to move beyond so let's go ahead and do that as our title now i'm going to copy this and i'm going to paste it down in my actual article as well and we're going to move to outlines and let's generate an outline and i actually think this is pretty good now i could generate more but the fact that I like this, I'm just gonna go ahead and go with it. All right, so let's just highlight our sections. I don't know what's going on there. That's kind of weird. I'm gonna highlight this though. I'm gonna make all those H2s. I'm gonna just paste it in another document. All right, we fixed that. So paste it in another document back into Brainwork. Now it will save as we move along. We have 158 words done already. I'm just gonna do a little cleanup here, but let's get started and actually write about what personalized marketing is. We'll click the paragraph button. Now, if I double click something and it's purple, then I can easily write. Whereas if I highlight a particular word, you see how it says 60%, I cannot write. So I'm just going to double click all of our H2s and we're gonna get our writing done rather quickly. And then we're just going to need to proofread and edit. So here we've written about 500 words and the content is pretty good. So the introduction says personalized marketing is a type of marketing is tailored towards the individual customer. It's different from traditional marketing. It takes into account desires, needs, and demographics. And then here it's going to honestly repeat pretty much the exact same thing. So I think I want to rephrase this just because it seems a little too specific to the introduction. Personalized marketing is when a company collects data about a customer's preferences, uses that information to create a unique marketing message for that customer. And then I'm just going to say personalized marketing, and we're going to click the green button, and it should write a little bit more about it. One of the most important trends in marketing today is the move to personalized marketing. So I do like that. And we'll need to double check this. 76%, 78%. Okay, so this is a good article that we can link out to. So we'll go ahead and do that. And what I'm gonna do is highlight a link. We'll put that in there. So that's pretty good there. Why is it important? So let's go ahead and take this and we're gonna click the write more button. Again, the green button down there. And it can say, how can businesses implement? I actually like that as an H2 tag. So let's go ahead and do that there. And I'm gonna delete how does it work and we'll put how to implement it instead. Okay. There are a few ways you can implement it. So this is repeating the exact same thing. So we need to delete this and that's the same. All right, so I don't like any of that. So instead, so I'm gonna go ahead and say that we can implement it through a tool like NextWeave. And then I'm gonna scroll up here. I'm gonna take their H tag and I'm going to paste it in. I wish I could paste in the actual value Instead of the formatted version, I've got to go into a different document to do it like that. And what we'll do here is click the green button and it'll do a little bit more writing for us. I've noticed that they're using the exact same thing 
often. I'm going to change that to just you can measure the effectiveness of personalized marketing. And then we're going to change it to say by using customer data to target specific ads for the individuals. And then I don't like that it's saying additionally multiple times. So we're going to take this last one and we're going to need to rephrase it. And by rephrasing it, we can say businesses can use customer feedback to figure out what they like and what they don't like. So let's keep going. What are the benefits? There's many benefits. For the benefits, I'm going to highlight what are the benefits. And we're going to go with listicle. So it'll give us some ideas. I'm going to highlight each of these. and I'm going to click paragraph. So I go ahead and do that. And then I can turn these into H3 tags as far as the benefits. Now I do see some redundancy there. So we're going to need to delete that out. But we've hit our thousand words. And for the most part, I think our article is coming along quite well. Um, we're going to need some images. For example, we're going to actually need personalized marketing. Now I did just pick up NextWeave from last call from AppSumo. So I'm still actually looking through it, setting it up, figuring that kind of thing out. But what I want to do is create a personalized marketing service. And that's one of the reasons uh, for this article here. So this is the baseline of something that I'm going to be actually implementing uh, to create a standalone service to make some money with NextWeave uh, from AppSumo. Hopefully this video brought you some value. Now I will say you need to add your own touch to the AI. And we've hit that thousand words and I've been recording for 16 minutes now from idea to execution. However, the editing is going to take me at least another 20 minutes. Realistically, I think you can turn out thousand word articles in about a half an hour. Shows you a little bit how I'm using something like Brainwork to write SEO friendly content. Now I'm at 1100 words right now. You'll see I've got 20% before I can use the little write for me tool again. But all in all, I've got the introduction. I've got what it is, why it's important. And this why it's important, I think I actually need to rewrite. I'm going to delete out this first part and I'm going to start it with saying when customers feel like a business has taken the time to personalize their experience, they're more likely to be loyal to that business. So let's go ahead and let's Google this and let's find this study. I think Brainwork's actually doing pretty good. And there it is. So we'll go ahead and take this study here. Personalized marketing is important because it helps businesses stand out from the competition. A study by Salesforce. And we're going to go with this right here, this stat here. And I'm going to paste this in, this 52%. So I'm just going to paste that exact sentence in. I really wish that they would let you paste match values. So I'm going to paste this into a different document and then we'll bring it back in here. We'll unbold it. And then I'm going to highlight this stat and we're going to go to rephrase and that's perfect. And then I'm going to make sure that it is a Salesforce article and it is. So all in all, I think I'm pretty much done. I'm very pleased with this article. And then what I would do here is I need to come in and actually come to the SEO tool. I'm at 59 now. So I need to make sure that my keyword is in the headings more. The title is a bit too long. And then we need to add a featured image. So let's go ahead and search for personalized marketing. And we'll add writing about personalized marketing. So I'm pretty much done. Now I could add more images here. I would probably recommend doing that. Obviously what I'm going to do is use NextWeave to create a custom personalized marketing experience. But if I wanted to share this, I can make this public and we can share this and you'll see personalized marketing revolution, scroll down and it looks pretty good. Not going to lie. So now before I get out of here, over here to the left, we see our assistant. We can turn it off. We no longer need it. We can preview it. We can save this. It auto saves. So we don't really need to save it. We can check the plagiarism. That's probably going to be pretty important. No plagiarism is found. This is powered by Copyscape. And we can download this as an HTML, PDF, doc, or text. And then, of course, we can watch their tutorials. I watched all of these earlier today. They're pretty good. They tell you exactly what you need to know regarding the tool. Give this video a like if it brought you some value. My name is Scott with AI Profits, and we'll see you in the next one.